So today we have currently 10 schools uh, representing over 60 countries in a number of committees. So in each of these committees, students will be uh, representing their own member state or country. I mean, it's a, it's a great learning experience. Um, they get to learn how to public speak, um, diplomacy, uh, they're negotiating with uh, you know, all these different schools. Uh, they're also representing policies of a country that's probably not their own, so they're also learning you know, different cultures, how to you know, play a role, and you know, often other countries' policies are very different than what your own personal beliefs are, so it kind of gets you to step into another country's shoes. Sinclair's hosted this for 23 years. It is a two-day event. It's all day-to-day. -day. Some of these schools, these, they've been doing it for years. They go to the national conference in New York. So they, you know, right for Wright State, for example, starts in the fall. So even their first-year delegates have had some time to prepare. So I'm just happy that we're here and, uh, you know, we'll see how it goes. Casey Peel. I go to school at Marietta College, who I am here with from all the United Nations. I'm pretty excited. Um, it's really fun when students come together and discuss international issues. Uh, my uh, committee happens to be COPUS, which is the Peaceful Uses of Outer Space which is not something that I'm typically well versed in because I'm more like I'm a political science student and this seems to be more science oriented but it introduces me to a lot of new topics that I'm not otherwise exposed to so it's pretty cool I'm learning things is this your first time here no it's actually my second time at Daymonk I came here two years ago okay. I'm Jacob Heidi I am from Sinclair uh, I'm technically a transfer student so I'm looking to transfer out here next fall to Texas A&M actually Oh, it's going very excellent. Um, I'm on the Simulated Security Council where we look at um, actual events that are happening in the world and they'll have, you know, terrorist attacks will occur, or there'll be refugee crises. And right now what we just broke to lunch on was a um, attack of the channel, which is that connecting tunnel underwater under the English Channel, a bomb went off. So that was what we were left off with and there's an internal strife within our Security Council as how is the best way to approach that and the refugees. Amani, Amani Master. And where are you from? I'm from east part of Tanzania, east part of Africa. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, and what college are you representing? Wright State University. Wright State, okay. Mm -hmm. So how are you feeling about today's event? I think it's great. It's going, it's going wonderful so far. Um, we are having some, a, lot of, yeah. a lot of work done. <laughs> mm -hmm. Why do you think this is a great opportunity for students? I think we get to learn a lot, we get to um, socialize a lot with a lot of people here. So. Okay. Uh, Josh Dunn. What are you focusing on today in the event? Uh, today I'm at the uh, UNESCO conference. Okay. And uh, right now we're debating Agenda uh, Issue 1, which is uh, the world's oceans and uh, how to sustain them, how to yeah. keep them clean, stop oil spills, stuff like that. What is the one thing you're looking forward to most? Um, probably the next agenda topic, uh, Issue 2, which is um, uh, sustainability goals post-2015. Okay. That's a wide, wide range of topics, uh, specifically poverty. Okay, is and is this your first time doing this? <laughs> uh, first time in college. I've done it uh, several times in high school. Okay. Which is good, but um, yeah, I appreciate the seriousness of the college class instead of uh, just a club. So. so what's your name? Allison. And what college are you representing? Um, Wright State. Okay, and is this your first time attending? Um, yes, actually it is. I'm currently on the Committee for Peaceful Uses of Outer Space, and we are um, focusing on sustainability in outer space. Okay, and what do you hope to learn with this experience? I hope to learn more leadership skills. What's your name? Uh, Austin. Okay, and who are you representing today? I'm representing Argentina. Okay, so what's happening with the event today? What are you focusing on? Uh, my committee is focused on space. Our, our committee is C-O-P-U-O-S. Don't ask me for what that means. I honestly don't know. <laughs> but um, what we're looking at right now, the topic we decide to uh, discuss is long-term sustainability in space. So we're tracking a lot of near-Earth objects, which is basically space trash, and how to mitigate all that, uh, make sure that Space is like universally acceptable for all the member states of the United Nations and make sure that we'll have long lasting peace up in space for whoever wants to send a satellite up there space exploration. Okay, and what college are you representing today? Uh, I'm from the University of Dayton. Okay, UD. Um, so when you're doing, um, presenting your speeches and debating, 
Are you on an Argentina team or are you a single person and then working with others? I'm a single person. We work with other member states typically whoever shares our same ideologies, but you as a single person represent whatever country it is. Okay. How excited are you to attend this? I'm a single person. And how's it going so far today? Uh, people are getting stuff done. And what college are you representing? Wright State University. Wright State, okay. Mm -hmm. so